Today is Thursday, January 10th, and as you can see, we've got a Hot Wheels Garage uh, video. Uh, Larry's Garage, actually. Uh, this is a 2009 series. Kind of, I, I had a lot of trouble finding it. I did find it on eBay. This box, you can see it's a little worn. There's a little tear there on the corners. It's a little worn, but it's not been opened. So, and the box, I don't really, you know, I want the box, but I don't care if it's got some damage. That's fine. Um, I did find it on a couple sites. Most places wanted like 150 for it. You know, that's just too much. I still paid too much for it, probably. I paid uh, $60 shipped. Uh, basically, somebody had it for like 60 and they had to buy it now. So I sent them a message saying, hey, if I buy it for 60 if you change it, buy it now, you know, throw some shipping in, what have you. Worked out a deal that way. So that's how I got it. And super quick shipping. I think I bought it on Monday and I got it today. It was uh, on the porch. Got some other items too, and I'll probably make a video of that later, maybe not tonight. Uh, right now with, bo uh, with work, I've just been too busy to really make a whole lot of videos. So again, this is uh, the 2009 Larry's Garage. It's a 21 car set. So here are the cars here. We'll tell you what they've got on the back. So you've got the, you've got a 69 Ford Mustang, a 56 Chevy, Mont uh, Metro Rail, Classic Packard, Wild Thing, GTO, Corvette 32 uh, sedan delivery, Ford 57 Bel Air, Purple Passion, three window, 34 uh, Ford, dairy delivery. Um, got a Mercury Cougar, T Bucket, So Fine, which uh, is a 50s car, it's chopped. Shift Kicker, 69 Camaro, 33 Roadster, Ford Roadster, Bone Shaker, 70 Mercury Cyclone, and a Passing Gasser. So We'll go ahead and open these up, but as you can see with all the garage ones, like the Walmart exclusives and whatnot, uh, all the cars are in a, like a little blister, and you've got one car that is carded, which happens to be the passing gasser. I will probably leave that carded. I probably won't take that out. Probably put that in a Protecto pack, and here are the other vehicles. So we'll go ahead and open this up, and we'll go over it uh, each car like we've uh, been doing with the rest, so stay tuned. Okay, we are back. And we're going to start with the uh, the passing gasser. It's pink, pretty cool uh, with the gray. Should really open it, but I just don't want to. So Larry's garage logo there. It's a metal chassis and rubber tires, real riders. Now all of these do have real riders. Not all of them have metal chassis which I thought that was uh, even advertised in the box. All oh, metal body. It does have a metal body, but not a metal chassis. So this uh, garage here is a little bit different. So that's the uh, passing gasser there. Again, sorry if it's not a real good look. Get some more light over here. But uh, I just don't want to take that one out. So the next one, this is one of the plastic chassis. It is rubber tire. I'm not going to go over all of them, but I'll tell you which ones are metal, which ones are not. So this would be the uh, dairy delivery. And I really like this one a lot. Even if it isn't a metal chassis. I'm not, the metal chassis really doesn't bother me that much. But it is a, it's a heavy casting because it's a big chunk of metal, the body, but it is a plastic uh, base. So. Let that one go for a little bit. Next one is a, pla or a uh, metal, metal base or chassis, whatever you want to call it. Beautiful car, big car. And that is the classic Packard. I think all of these, yeah, all of these do have supposedly Larry's signature, what have you. Let's see if we can, right there. So far, all the ones that I see do have it. Now, I'm sure he didn't sign every car. It's part of the casting. Okay. We'll move to the next one here. Let's see. It's the Pontiac. 
It's a 67 Pontiac GTO. This one is a metal chassis. Love that green paint. Next one is a 68 Mercury Cougar. Metal chassis also. This has got like a black metal flake. Don't really care for the flames, but I do like the casting. Again, that's a metal base. So most of them are metal base. They're just some that are not. Okay, there we go. I think this one is the So Fine. Maybe wrong on that. I believe that's a So Fine. Either that or, I don't know. Not all of them say at the bottom. This is one of them that doesn't, which I usually know cars, but I just don't know. And that one is a plastic chassis, by the way. Now this next one, I'm looking at the listing on, okay, now there is one. But the, this is a 56 Chevy. I only saw 57, I'm like, no, that's wrong, it's 56. So there's a 56, and that's an all metal chassis as well. This next one's a plastic chassis. I don't really like the casting at all, but I'll keep it because it's part of the set. And that's the Metro Rail, I believe. And this next one's an all-metal chassis as well. Purple Passion. Now, some of these cars, these all do have the little signature, like that's on the bottom of the uh, tranny there but uh, it's like a, like a yellowish hue it's like an older an older uh, base anyway that's purple passion if you didn't guess that kind of, this is next one's one of my favorite cars but I'm shocked that it has a plastic chassis that's uh, 68 cyclone Or not 68, 70, I think. Yeah, 70. And one of my second favorite cars, which is coming up next here, it also has a plastic base. It's the 57 Chevy. Plastic base. This next one is one of my least favorite. It does have an opening hood. Right there, it barely opens. And this is a plastic chassis, but that's the wild thing. This next one's also a plastic chassis. And this is the shift kicker. And that one, I'm, eh, I'm okay with that one. And another one of my favorite cars, yet again, another plastic chassis. 69 Camaro. Another favorite here, Tea Bucket. Plastic chassis. This 
68 Corvette metal chassis. I keep on calling it chassis, base, whatever. I'm more of a car guy, so everything's a chassis to me. Now this next one I don't normally get into, but really like this one. It does have a metal chassis, actually. One of the ones I like, at least. That's the bone shaker. I'm not a big bone shaker. Well, originally I wasn't a big bone shaker fan, but I'm starting to come around on that. This next one's one of my favorites also. Yet another plastic chassis, but the 69 Ford Mustang. I just love the stance of that car. Next we have, uh, I think this is a 33 Roadster. That's a metal chassis. We've only got two more to go here. The last two are also metal chassis. Like I said, there's quite a few plastic, but I, that doesn't bother me. And we've got the three window Ford. Really like that one. But I probably like this next one better. Doesn't roll worth the hoot, but not important. We've got the last but not least 32 Ford sedan delivery. I really like that one. And that's it. Try not to talk too much in this one, so just wanted to show you the cars. Again, that's a 21 car set. Um, I, I don't think it's worth the hundred and some bucks that you find it for on like uh, Amazon and all that junk, but for, you know, whatever. Yeah, the, the, the big box does say metal body, rear rotor tires. Well, I guess I mean by metal body is the actual body. But usually with all these other garage series and boulevard, it says metal body. Oh no, maybe it says all metal. Yeah, I think it does. Yeah, it actually says metal metal on all the other garage ones. And this just says metal body. So, that's not a, a, an error, I guess. So, anyway, if you have any questions or comments, post those below. Hopefully this weekend I'll be posting some more videos. Uh, maybe even tomorrow. Um, some good ones, we'll see. Well, some openings, some unboxings. So, till then, if you have any questions or comments, post it below. Please subscribe and thanks for watching.